गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू इन आर इंग्लिश क्लास वी हैव बीन डूइंग द चैप्टर लैंडस्केप ऑफ द सोल बाय नेथली ट्रुब्रॉय कपल ऑफ वीडियो आई हैव ऑलरेडी अपलोडेड यू दिस इज द लास्ट फेज ऑफ द चैप्टर दैट आई एम गोइंग टू इंट्रोड्यूस एंड दिस फेज इज एन आर्टिकल दैट वाज पब्लिश्ड इन 2005 इन द हिंदुस्तान टाइम्स here in your book the title getting inside outsider art what is outsider art outsider art is called raw art it will be there in your book if we proceed to the chapter so this art is made by those people who have received no formal training or no formal education of making mainstream paintings what is mainstream mainstream means as the name says those paintings those are liked by majority of people and this concept is under development at that time and those artist those are in this raw art they have deep insight in showing their art in painting deep insight means though they do not have any institutional degree or certificate they do not have any proof that they are professional but when they involve in the, the artistic creation so they do marvelous because they have deep insight in showing their art in painting and such work such artistic creation in other words we say art brut what is art brut art brut is a concept that was introduced by jean dubuffet so this is all that is needed to be explained so rest of the things so they are given in the chapter but still would like to throw light on a few sentences that are there in your book when french painter jean dubuffet so till now so you have come to know about jean dubuffet and his concept that was art brut when jean dubuffet mutin mutin here means introduced the concept of art brut what is art brut you already know in 1940 in the decade of 40 he introduced this concept and the art of untrained visionary so in other words it has been explained that art brut so art brut this is the work of untrained visionary those who actually they are trained they are trained from deep insight but they are not called professional people they do not accept them as professional so that art of untrained visionary was of minority interest minority interest means minor a few people they were interested in that type of art from its almost very beginning the beginning was done by jean dubuffet and that beginning that was not in full exposure that was veiled so what is veil so it's used in past participle veiled means covered when a woman she has to hide her face so it's a custom tradition in india in some area a woman she has to hide her face so that piece of cloth that is called veil that is called cover so here it means the beginning was 
not in uh, abundant it was veiled it was hidden it was not exposed to the many people that beginning of outsider art has gradually become gradually means slowly it become the fastest growing area of interest in contemporary art internationally internationally in contemporary art means the art that was prevailing that was in mainstream mainstream paintings mainstream arts so this art that outside art it started coping up with the mainstream art means it began to develop internationally next this genre this is not a genre this genre means style in simple words you can say is described as art of those who have no right to be artist as they have received no formal training so i have already explained to you because those artists those who belongs to outsider arts so people do not accept them as artist next their work are a stimulating stimulating means inspiring contrast to a lot of mainstream offering coming to next around the time dubbefit was propounding propounding here means creating developing introducing or make honing it his concept when he was creating that concept in india an untutored genius genius means scholar wise person who has deep insight untutored already it has been explained many times and it means that is not tutored that is not taught that is not trained that genius was creating paradise means the concept that time the concept that was being developed so during that time simultaneously a person who was untutored though he is called junius out of his work so he was creating paradise so what paradise is there in years ago a little patch of jungle that he began clearing to make himself a garden sculpted with stone and recycled material with the help of stone and with the help of recycled recycled materials thrown away materials wastage materials so with the help of that material he made a paradise and what is this paradise that is known to the world means all over the world that is known as the rock garden that is situated at chandigarh in chandigarh everybody knows about the rock garden the beautiful art and that art that was made by designed by mr nekchand single handed man that was the man that behind this work the creation of rock garden so rest of the thing in next couple of paragraphs so it's written about the recognition award reward and the honor that he received he invited many place not only in india throughout the globe he was invited he was published in many magazines and newspaper his creation that highlighted in on the cover page of numerous magazine here is described the uk based magazine and now again he is called the article that was written in 2005 so in that article so that's the future plan 
in 2005 so he was invited in a month to come the article that was written from onward in month to come so he will be honored by so that's a will be word that has been used here having received many award reward recognition honor he is really very happy but his most satisfaction part so what is his most satisfactory reward he says that is written at the end of the article the biggest reward is walking through the garden and seeing the people enjoy my creation that is the biggest reward in the world of Mr. Nathan people they come to his garden they walk in the garden they enjoy the creation of Nathan and that time the inner satisfaction that he received that he gets so that is the biggest reward for him so the concept that was there about outside art art brood and draw art so i have explained you so rest of the thing that i didn't explain so it's just the honor that was received by nature so you will do better thanks a lot